Hey everyone, it's Fahrenheit4051 here, and what I have here is a Faraday 7410. That is not an error, this is actually a 7410, not to be confused with the more common 5410, also known as the Simplex 4050. Um, now, the difference between this and the uh, 5410 is that this, as I don't know if you can tell right here, has a non-perforated diaphragm, so it's completely flat. Compare that with the Faraday 5640, aka the DC version of the uh, 5410 or 4050. Um, you can see right here the, um, the diaphragm is raised and it's a lot more robust. So when I ordered this horn, I'd realized after I ordered it that I may have made a mistake. If you look at the back here and compare it with this horn, which is a pretty good comparison for the AC version, it looks almost the same. You can see that there's something missing. Where's the electromagnet? I thought, so what I thought had happened is that somebody had decided to sell the horn shell with the electromagnet itself actually torn off, I guess. Torn off and sold for a copper scrap or whatever. But when I received the horn in the mail, I was pleasantly surprised to see that there was indeed an electromagnet, albeit a very tiny one. So what this actually is, is a buzzer, or essentially a mini horn. It's not as, it's not as powerful as the, uh, the 5410, and it only draws, let's see, 0 0.035 amps of current, or 35 milliamps. Um, the sound is similar, it is an AC powered horn, so it has that distinct dryer buzzer sound but it's noticeably less powerful than one with a full-size electromagnet. So now in the uh, next portion, we are going to actually test this and see what it sounds like. All right, so now let's test this thing. Um, as you can see, I do have it plugged directly into a surge protector with the wire leads just in there. This is not how you should be hooking this thing up. Don't try this at home for the love of electrical safety, but I'm going to do it, so here it goes. So that was kind of loud, but much quieter than a full-fledged 4050. It's just like, essentially a dryer buzzer. So that's pretty cool. Alright, thanks everyone for watching. See you later.